they've started digging it, but I was consulted to come and give an advice how to go about it. That means here will be 10. Because of the okay. rock work. Mm -hmm. Yes. Good morning, viewers. I'm here to show you how to construct a pond. I've been thinking of it, um, it lately to show you how I construct my pond. And so lot, one of my customers contacted me this morning to construct a pond for her. So I'm going to show you how I go about it. I'm going to show you from the beginning to, to the end how I do, I construct my pond. Hope you will like it. Hope you guys will like the video. Make sure you follow me because I'm going to give you all the details of what I'm going to do. I'm going to show you how I'm going to construct the pond, where I'm going to position it because my customer says he wants 10 points. Like I used to stop his um, finger leg. So I have to make sure where I'm going to position it is going to be the best place for me to position it, where that place is good. I'm going to build it to his satisfaction, to make sure he's satisfied with it. So watch and look at how I'm going to go about it. Guys, follow me around the farm for me to show you how I'm going to start the construction of the pond. Make sure you subscribe, like, and share. Share it so that it will go viral. Make sure you support your Gar Cafe's family. Thank you. Hello, viewers. Good morning to all of you. Um, I was contacted by one of my customers to come and then give her an advice on how to create her pond. As you can see, they've already dug here. So I'm just here to give her advice how to go about it. I'll give you all the details how to create a pond, how to go about it, how to do your outlet, your inlet, how to make sure everything is done perfectly well, that you don't get any problem, how to cement it, and how you are going to go by it, whether you are going to use a, a waterproof cement or put out, but I'll, I'll, I'll be sure I'll teach you everything you have to know in creating a pond. Hello viewers, I'm here to introduce the um, customer, the woman that contacted me for the um, constructing of the pond. This is the woman. Madam, please, what's your name? Evelyn. And please, this is the contractor that is handling the, um, the cement work. Please, what's your name, sir? Please come louder, small. Mr. Osain. So as you can see, this is Mr. Osain. And it's, this is the brother of the woman that contacted me. Richie. Mr. Richie. So as I told you that I'm going to show you everything I'm going to do. I'm going to show you how I'm going to go about it. As they showed me everything, I'm going to start from the scratch, then do the piping and everything. But I will keep you updated for you to know how I'm going to go about it. That means here will be 10. Because of the okay. block work. Because of the block work, we have to extend it small. 11 and then here will be 8. 8, okay. Okay, and then make sure uh, the slope will go like this because the face will face this place. It's going to face here. That's where it's supposed to face. So, so that I can even stand here and feed them. But then the slope should go like this because you put a bend for all the water. Put the bend in the when you put the bend like this. When the water is coming here, it will be sloping and then be going inside the water. So it will not, you understand what I'm saying? That's the reason why we have to make it slope so that at least the water can go out easily without any problem. If each, each pond is like this, eh? Let's say for instance, if each pond is like this, let me give you guys. If the pond is here, we will put when I put the bend in it, I have to put outside it, I have to put the air valve. Air valve outside. That immediately I remove it and draw it. The water will start coming itself. When you have to now be a pipe or now that you open a tap before it will come out. What is the mega natural? When I I'll just put the air valve outside the this thing. When you do that, we put the bend. What's that? You see the air valve I'll put outside. Eh? So when, whenever you want to just take the water, you just remove the air valve. The water will stay coming. I'm going to tell you, I think I'll be able to call it. Just the air valve, you just remove the air valve from it. Because then you need to do that. If it's your neighbor, no. How long can I stay? Okay, but you have to do that. You see? Slope, oh no. Eh, yeah. Let me see. Let me see. Let me see whether I can set it for you. It's a baby thing. And only around short. You see, when you put it, a shemu dada. Eh? A shemu concrete. A shemu concrete. From inside, when you start, you start doing your squeezing or 
Thank you. 